So by now we're all familiar with the concept of a candy star. I've got other tutorials up, but essentially you add 10 beads to a piece of string, tie it off, literally as tight as you possibly can, and then squinch the beads around until you've got this five-sided shape. Cut off the short end of the string and run the long end through one of the corners. Add three beads. Run your string through the next corner over. Pull it tight to make a point and repeat that all the way around the star. Voila. Uh, when you get to the end, you can either tie it off or you can literally just make a bracelet with the leftover string dangling out of the end. We all know this. We're all familiar with it, right? But did you know you could also make Patrick Star? You can make Spongebob too. Actually, you can make a bunch of different iconic characters just by changing the color pattern on the beads that you're using. The pattern you're going to start with for Patrick specifically is going to be five pink and then green, purple, green, purple, green. And I've got it upside down here with point facing the bottom because when you add points, this is going to be the top. This is going to be his head. And then there'll be two points coming down here for his legs. As you go through when you're adding, when you add his legs, it's going to be green, pink, green, green, pink, green. And then when you add his arms and head, it's just all pink. So three pink, three pink, three pink, green, pink, green, green, pink, green. I'm showing you how to do it this way with the beads on the table so that you can do this yourself with whatever characters you want. As long as you can lay out a color scheme that fits that number and style of bead, you can do it as a star. Happy crafting!